Good morning or good afternoon Moodle Nation. I'm going to create a short video for students. If you're logging in to Moodle for the first time, this video is for you. And this will also show you how to register to your teacher's course. First of all, we have to go to an address. The address is um, lms.apiu.edu. Let me maximize that. There you go, lms.apiu.edu. And then, oops, let me just log out from my account. And then you log in with your user account. So if your user account, in uh, the, the username that you use for Sarah is 2018001143, do not add the at sign, just the number and your Sarah password. Okay, so I'm going to use a test user, which I think this one, Mood Tester. And I log in. And the first thing that Again, if you're using Moodle for the first time or LMS for the first time, the first thing that Moodle will ask is for you to update your email, your email address right here. You can update other things, but the most important thing is email address. So I'll update that. Okay, Not update, but actually fill it in because there's no email there. Time zone is okay. You, since we are in Thailand, just put Thailand. Saraburi. If you have your profile picture ready with you, you can just upload a profile picture later on. Okay, so that's it. Just click update profile. Okay, this email is already in use. Um, let me use another email. Um, let's see. Um, I'll use my Gmail. Now this is very important because if your teacher or your instructor wants to communicate with you uh, through Moodle, you will receive it in Moodle and you will receive a copy in your email address that you registered here. Okay, so I clicked update profile and after that you will see this message is saying it's just saying you received an email from Moodle so please go to your email and there's a link right there so I'll go to my email which is Gmail Oops, that's not the one sorry I'm already logged into that one let me get another okay try to make this video as short as possible okay and then you will see an email now if it's not in your inbox probably it's your in, in it's it's in your spam folder but right in, it's it's in my updates folder tab so it's, it's here the title is confirmation of email update at learning management system so it says dear your username just click that one and there's a link just click that link and that's it your your email is already verified so I'll go back to my account now there you go the email is there already and I'm ready to click update again and done it's finished so the next step is to enroll to a course so let's let's get familiar with the, the dashboard first um, you have this menu here dashboard okay this is uh, I don't have to do the tour I know this already I'm doing the tour for you um, so I'll click and tour so here you will see the courses that you are enrolled in right now it says all all courses maybe perhaps it's past course or current course or future course courses that you have uh, yeah, you will take so I you can select in progress course the courses this semester future and the past so I'll just use in progress there's nothing there so we're trying to enroll to Mr. Carlton's course um, I'll look for that course shortly on this sidebar you also have um, different items like private files who are the online users in the Moodle nation and the calendar what are the upcoming events if your teacher has set uh, a, 
um, an assignment with a due date you will see it there let's go back to the left side uh, we have site home we have calendar and private files you can you can explore what private files is as, as the name suggests it's your files private files calendar is also will also show you what are the due dates that your teacher set for your courses but since we don't have any courses enrolled in yet we go to site home and then here you will see the list of faculties the semesters and the faculties um, since we are enrolling for a course in faculty of arts and humanities let's click that one and um, I believe this is the one this is mr. Carlton's course ENGL 2235 strategies for reading you can do this for other courses if you are enrolled in those courses so I'll access mr. Carlton's course just click access the next thing that it will ask is an enrollment key the enrollment key is usually the course code so ENGL all caps 2235 just copy that one and put it here and then click enroll me once you do that once you're done you will be given a tour again just click in and this is where you will actually see the assignments announcements forums quizzes online whatever that mr. Carlton will publish right now it's empty because it's a new course okay so if you want to see other courses that you're enrolled in you just go to courses and then click or you go to your dashboard and you will see now that I have strategies for reading on my dashboard so I hope you enjoy using Moodle and enjoy learning God bless